you took the one thing Mr. Serene needed to survive, Dr. Amaral. That made you priority one. Yeah, they made that clear. Monarch lined every escape route with barricades, roadblocks. I had to get to the mainland, but I couldn't do it by car. Needed a new plan. All right, let's go. Beth, I think I'm gonna need a ride. The streets are too hot. All right, where do you want me? I'll let you know as soon as I find some higher ground and get a good look at the situation on the bridge. I think it might be a no-go. <laughs> Gotta get to higher ground. I'm looking at the bridge right now. It's a lot of Monarch. I don't know, maybe you could sneak across? Well, maybe. Or I could pick you up. Let me know. I'm pretty exposed out here, so try to make it fast. I'll be a lot better when you get me on that boat. Monarch's right on my ass. I'm not exactly making friends out here. That was Dr. Amaral. Don't kicking and screaming. How long do you need to get here? That depends. Let me check. So, we don't know where he is. We can't, uh, we can't find him. So we need to look into Still there? a, you know, a... Yeah, just uh, looking for a viewpoint. A replacement. All ponies are made of butter in Night Springs! Ah! The Kratzu things happening in Kitu of Negat Springs. Thank you. All ponies are made of butter in Night Springs. We know the old dance, the fo um, fortunate and the destitute. The haves and the haves, have nots. Those who dine at the table and those who starve in the street. But the tables can be over. Uh, but the tables can be turned. The gluttonous consumer may find himself a consumable resource. Do that again. And yet, that is the fate that awaits you in Night Fringe. It's Night Springs. Night Cringe. Springs. Bright blings. Night spring. Fright. Winch. Jesus. We know the old dance. The fortunate and the destitute. The haves and the have-nots. Those who dine at the table and those who starve in the street, but the tables can be turned. The gluttonous consumer may find himself the consumable resource in night. Springs. Right things. on Joyce or Wilder. Doing another sweep. I can't stay here long, Jack. You're gonna need to be quick. Yeah, 
about that. Bad news? Reoccurring theme of the night. I'm looking at the bridge right now. If I go anywhere near that thing, there's gonna be innocent people caught in the crossfire. All right. Any bright Thanks ideas? Thanks for patience, folks. We'll have you on your way again soon. Uh, let me see. There's a pier under the bridge. You should be able to meet me there with the boat. Giant gas sign out front. Can't miss it. It's nice and bright for Monarch to see. There's not a lot of options. I'm switching to Monarch frequencies. Be in touch soon. I'll be there in a few minutes. Don't stand me up. Okay, how are we getting down there? Where's the fire pole? For those of you just tuning in, the manhunt continues as authorities search for Jack Joyce, the suspect in last night's university terror attack. Joyce may also have been involved in a firefight at the Monarch Mansion on Gaul Island. We're helping the police looking for a Have you seen anything out of the ordinary? Plan to meet Beth went out the window as soon as the stutter hit. Her boat couldn't get to you. No, but it gave me an opportunity to climb up on the bridge and cross it, slip right past Monarch, or less undetected. I should get up on that bridge and make my way across it before the stutter ends.
scene on the bridge was unreal. They weren't cops. They had no authority to do this. But the Monarch PR machine had done its job. Here they were, the heroes protecting everybody. And you were the terrorist. Yeah. Listen, if you see him, don't try to approach him. Just call the number, okay? It's even worse than my passport picture. Just watch Just yourself. be patient, folks. We're just making sure everybody's safe. Damn bridge and I'll be clear. Thank <laughs> you. 
This is so bad. I knew I'd be dead if the stutter collapsed while I was in the frozen crash. I had to reach solid ground and the deck of the cargo ship was my best bet. Just had to find a way down. I knew I'd be dead if the stutter collapsed while I was in the frozen crash. I had to reach solid ground and the deck of the cargo ship was my best bet. Just had to find a way down. Somehow, I had to find my way across. Hope for the best. heading downwards, towards the cargo ship. The route down wasn't exactly user-friendly. The fracture was getting much worse. Timelines getting scrambled. Caught in violent loops, off sync. Crashing into each other. This was what the end of time would look like. Everything was broken. In chaos. Frozen. And no one would know. Objects were moving out of time, out of order, entire timelines overlapping. And it was going to get worse, unless we could stop it. You don't understand the power you're wielding. You need to hand this technology over to Monarch. I've prepared for what happens next. You say you're prepared, but no part of this plan of yours involves stopping it from happening. Even if I fix William's machine, what could you possibly hope to achieve? The end of time is coming. There's no way to- Hey! This isn't a debate. I just watched a ship fast forward through a fucking bridge. Time is running out. And the fracture's getting worse by the minute. And it cannot be stopped. Paul has been to the end of time. He's witnessed it firsthand. Can't you see? We prepared for what's next out of necessity. Your research is based on work by William Joyce. You respected him. He knew that the fracture would occur, but he also knew that it could be fixed. Will built a way to stop the fracture. This. The countermeasure. We're traveling to the past to retrieve it. You can help us get there faster. Or... You can agree to disagree. I'll have to run diagnostics on the machine. I can't promise anything before that. Amy, take Amaral to the machine. Keep an eye on her. Sure thing. Okay, doctor, let's go. And I 
can see right through you. Don't try anything stupid. You will regret it. Jack, before we head downstairs, we have to talk about something. Okay, what's up? It's about the plan. If Amaral gets the machine working... We go back to yesterday and undo all of this. Listen, in the video Will left for me, he said the countermeasure was stolen from his workshop on July 4th, 2010. He also said I took it. Maybe I did, Jack. We have a time machine. You're saying we go to 2010. We steal it. If Will was right, that would mean it wouldn't be a change. We take the countermeasure, bring it to the present, fix the fracture, save the world. Okay. Explain to me why that's a better plan than just going back to yesterday and preventing all this from happening in the first place. Because I'm afraid that based on what I know about time travel, we can't change anything. The past has already happened. We can't change it. But my way, we don't have to. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, my plan still feels simpler. Let's just get the machine working. This was the guy delivering the speech at the gala. Potential ally? Not even close. Hello, Riverport. Well, it's been a rough night for us. The collision at the Port Donnelly Bridge that has claimed multiple lives is still being investigated. At least Let's see how Dr. Amaral's doing with the time machine. Yeah. I don't think we can trust her. The way she looked at the countermeasure like she's seen it before. She knows what it does. You think Will told her about it? No. Will was never the kind to open up. I can relate. Will takes it to the next level. When we were kids, the only way that Will could express anything important to me was by informing my stuffed giraffe when I was in the room. It's precious. And weird. Did she find anything? I'm not sure. I'll go check. How long do you need? I already found the problem. Quite simple, really. The power relay is down. You'll need to find a way to reset it up. There. Where the light is. I'll lower the ladder for you. <coughs> what happened to the power relay? Power surge occurred at 7 a.m. this morning. And the machine was activated. Okay. The console here's got two red lights, one green one. You'll have to reset the power to the two stations with the red lights before activating the relay. Both stations are located above the machine. Just follow the cables to the red lights. Above the machine. The perfect place for a reset switch, Will. Okay, the first red light is now green. You've got to be kidding me. What is it? This is all my stuff from our family home. I can't 
everything. Hmm. Guess you thought you might come back. What's wrong? Toto. That's my signature. You made this? I've never even been here before. That woman in the picture is you, isn't it? So... Jack. There's something you should know. 1999. I was eight years old, playing in my backyard, and a woman approached me, told me she was from the future. She gave me very specific details of events that would come to pass. She gave me this. Filled with dates, events, proof of it all. Jack, that woman... It was you. Everything I told myself would happen, did. Every detail, for better or worse, came to pass and couldn't be changed. Our fate is laid out before us, Jack. Everything that happened to get us here, every sacrifice that was made, they're all a part of this path. And they can't be changed or undone. Beth. When we step in that time machine, you will see for yourself. All right, if you're that sure about how all this works, we can try it your way. The notebook was full of dates, events that would come to pass, instructions. Her entire existence was formed out of those pages. It's her. She's the one who's been painting all over the city. <sighs> Jesus. Climbable. How would your brother put maintenance controls way up there? That's exactly the kind of question that...
functional. That fixed it. Come on down. Okay. Okay, we're doing this. I'll set the date into the console. July 4th, 2010. Are you ready? No. Are you? No. Okay. Let's go. This is it. There's no turning back. Hey, wait, wait! What did you do? That was the wrong door. You changed the date. Where is she? Where is she? I had no choice. I couldn't let you take the countermeasure. It would put our entire plan at risk. I already called Monarch from the terminal. They're on their way. It's over. What did you do? Fuck! We need the countermeasure to run the lifeboat. I'm gonna follow through with the plan. Tie her up and get as far away from here as you can. I will. You just take care of yourself, Jack. Okay? Your first journey back in time, 2010. This is where our notes get hazy. You know how it ended. Your goal when you arrived was to retrieve the countermeasure. But my goal had to wait, because I wasn't alone. What's going on here? Since when did Will run a graffiti workshop? None of this crap was here in 2016. Someone's in here. This 
is it. There's no turning back. Jack? Dr. Emerald sent me to the future. I fought for months trying to find a way to get back. I wasn't the only one. set William's machine to 1999. The first possible exit point. Don't shoot! Hey, don't hey, shoot! Hey, don't hey, shoot! Hey, it's okay! Hey! It's okay! Ah. It's okay! I'm on your side. Who are you? I'm Beth Wilder. There's some things you need to... You're the reason he built the countermeasure. And you've been here ever since. Eleven years. Why? Why didn't you come back? We should get ready. We don't have much time. She had changed. And there was a weight in her eyes. She was hiding something. She always was. I can't do this can't anymore. anymore. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't fucking do this. What exactly do you believe changed in Beth? She lost hope. Unlock the door. So where's Will? Where's the countermeasure? The countermeasure's at William's workshop. Where he built it. Then that's where we go. Uh, yes. That was the plan. I just have to unlock this. Supplies are upstairs. We'll need to get them. There's so much you don't know that you never saw. I... I gave up on the idea that she would ever come. Things are in the cafeteria upstairs.
I need to know we're still in this together. I told you once our fate is already laid out for us. Still believe. All right. More than ever. I'm just worried what that might mean. It means we finish this. Gear? Take whatever you need. The rest of it's going in the river. Along with everything else I brought here. That's a little drastic. My time here is done, Jack. I have to erase my presence. Let me know when you're ready to go. You followed Paul to 1999. Why did he travel so far back? To form Monarch. Prepare for what's coming. You kept tabs on him. And he's kept tabs on me. I can't imagine what happened to you. When you entered that machine, I wanted to go after you, but I didn't know where Sophia sent you or how to find you. You made it here. It's all that matters. You followed the plan. Whatever happened to you, we'll change it. Don't. We can fix this. Don't. We can undo this. Oh, you still don't get it. <laughs> it can't be changed. No matter what we do, the pieces fall in all of the exact same places. I've tried. Over and over. I can't just sit back and do nothing. You have to let go. Jack. You have to let go. I've seen it. The end of time. That is where she sent me. I was there. I've been fighting this fight my entire life, and I saw us fail. I saw where this leads. I just don't know anymore. I don't know if we can win this thing. die finding out. I don't know a fraction of the hell that Beth went through, what she experienced when she saw the end of time, how that changed her, like it changed Paul, followed by 11 years of living like a ghost. Beth I'd known had laser focus. This Beth... She had doubts. You okay? Yeah. <sighs> but the countermeasure, the one thing that could set things right was waiting for us at Will's workshop.
In 2010, Monarch didn't own the area yet. That came shortly after because of what happened with you. But we knew William was building something new in his workshop, and we knew it must be important. We were monitoring the place. Yeah, Beth knew about your presence. She'd done spying on her own. We came over the rooftops to avoid detection. Does Will know we're coming? No, he doesn't. I can't believe we're stuck working on the 4th of July. Hey, you don't have to do this. this point on, we may be in their sights. We need to be quick. Hey, Will? He's not here. I made sure of that. What? Why? He's the only one that knows how to use the countermeasure. Which is why he needs to be kept safe. In case... things go bad. Fine. We get the device. Then you lead me to my brother. Sure. Now, where do we find this thing? We'll send the security and set it safe. Somewhere in the building. All right, well. Let's see here. Where'd you hide that safe? It was all there on the board. The details of his downward spiral. His work consumed him. The device was some there. kind of desperate obsession. But it must have been at one time. He was never the same. The power setup wasn't working. But it must have worked at some point. Maybe I can rewind time to get this working. life for 11 years. Yeah. He didn't leave the code, but I can crack it. I just need some time to... Somebody's here. It's Monarch. I knew it. I knew they'd find us. I'll take care of it. Just get that safe open, stay inside. Yeah. Okay. You'd been spotted the moment you arrived. You never had a chance. You were on a suicide mission. Yeah. I wasn't gonna lie down and just give up without a fight. Not then, not ever. This is Trojan 1, approaching workshop perimeter. Over. Years. Remember, orders are to take her alive. Monarch Actual's en route. I have no idea but how to do this. How to pay for it. I don't know. 
Wilder's from the future. And she came to me. I have to assume that I was successful, right? Why else would she come to me? He was planning on giving it to you. But it was stolen before they had a chance. There's some things you need to eat. This is the only way to play out. Stop right there. Where's the girl? Hey, 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 hold on. Take it easy. Seems to be the problem, guys. On your knees, now! Trojan 4, we're going inside. I can't let him. He's got a gun! Open fire! I have to give up.
call. Gotta get back in. Give me the device. Come with me. We can survive this together. You know it can't be stopped. I can see it in your eyes. You know this. What if you're wrong? We created Ground Zero. Caused everything to happen how it always did. Every piece falling into place. Except one. The blast sent you through time. Brought you back to 2016. The same exact time from which you left. Something anchored you there. We need to know how you did this. You think I wanted to come back? I was pulled away. Everything I came for was still back there. Left behind. Serene had the countermeasure the whole time. I had to get it back. A rash decision. You claim Beth Wilder's death had no impact on your behavior, but... Like I said, I barely knew her. So, what you did next? It wasn't personal? No. I don't have much time left, I know. I spent 17 years working it out, planning it, 
building Monarch. Because I knew what was coming, and I knew it couldn't be stopped. But what I've built has been turned against me. What is the point in saving them if I can't trust them? <sighs> I'm slipping away into pain and rage. The sickness is accelerating. The CFR. It has cost me so much. But I have harnessed its power. And with it, my plan will work. With it, I will keep the lights on when the world goes dark. Mr. Serene, sorry to disturb you, sir, but I have that cleanup report on Dr. Kim's lab you wanted. Meet me in my office, soldier. I'll be there when I've sealed the CFR chamber. Explosion. My treatments all gone. First things first, seal the chamber. The CFR has been secured. Uh, Mr. Serene, I'm in your office. I'll be right there. Serene out. The soldiers know how close to the end I am. I'm not afraid of death. I'm afraid of becoming the enemy. What that would mean for me, for the plan. Ah! I don't know who to trust anymore. <laughs> Sophia Amaral. She wanted to activate the lifeboat before it was ready. She wants to sabotage my operation. Who knows what she's told Jack? Who knows how long she's been working against me? Sir? Be right with you, son. Report. Sir, you ordered us to search the demolished lab. Your treatments were destroyed, but there was one left. The casing appears to be broken, but uh, it's all we could find. One of my treatments. But it's damaged. Is it safe to use? Uh, sir? I didn't catch that. Or is it a trap? Another betrayal. The treatment will make me weak. Is that what they want? Can any of them be trusted? I'm not a traitor. We're the same now. And I need your help. I can focus on the mission. The lifeboat. See it through to the end. I still have allies I can trust. Look, you have to realize you're not gonna keep me from getting to CFR. Last chance to walk away, Joyce! Liam Burke. He would fight to defend us, to slow Jack down. The plan could still work. Sir? Thank you. I'll be right down. Dismissed. Yes, sir.
feel more clear-headed, calmer, but it won't last. I need to work fast while I still can. Bradbury swimming pool. Poor Sawin's become unhinged. What about my treatments? He's triggered a catastrophe. The Joyce Field could collapse within eight hours. He has the chance to fix it, but he's choosing not to. He's choosing to let things end. And this is where we come in. Good evening, Dr. Amaral. We're five minutes out, Mr. Hatch. I've come to free you, my friend. It's time for you to rejoin the others, to return to the infinite. What was troubling me? is who got them in the Kim's lab. She paid a visit minutes before the explosion. I need her found now. Liam? Yeah. So I have some information about Warren Hatch. I want him apprehended immediately. 